today's video, I'm going to be renovating Gate Nightclub in Bloxburg. So if you didn't know, I have a renovation series on my channel where I renovate all the existing Bloxburg buildings. So if you want to go watch them before watching this video, it'll be linked in my description. So this is the outside of the nightclub. The outside's not too bad. Okay, but here's the thing with the inside, right? I only found out literally like last month that the inside of the club was a thing. There's like a whole secret room back here and I didn't even know that because it was so dark. But yeah, this is the inside of the nightclub. You can't really see anything. I feel like they could have added more lights all above here just so you can see like what's going on. We have a little DJ booth up here. I like this sign, the whole like beat nightclub. That's pretty cool. I'm definitely gonna incorporate that into my renovation. And then we just have like a little bar over here. And then if we come back here into the pitch black nothingness, we have the second floor, which is just like more seating. But yeah, that is the beat nightclub. And now it is time to renovate her. So let's get started. Okay, so here's my little Bloxburg town so far. I can't believe we've already built like five stores. That went by so fast. And the plot value is 441,000, which is just crazy. That's literally nearly half a million. It will definitely be half a million once I start this nightclub. And I'm thinking of adding the nightclub next to BFF Supermarket because I feel like right here is like the perfect measurement to put it. Yeah, I feel like that is plenty of room. And of course, we're going to be making it two story. Okay, now because this is the original nightclub, I like these four beams that come out. So for me to make this work, I'm just going to use like really big pillars. See like that, how it comes out. And then we'll have two pillars on the side where the doors are. Also going to have a sign up here that says like, beat nightclub but for me to spell out the beat I think it's kind of made out of basic shapes so that's what I'm gonna do it's gonna be a little bit tricky but I've done it with BFF supermarket but everyone was like Alaska that B looks like an eight and okay I see your point it definitely does so hopefully we will make it better this time okay so there's the sign that's gonna say like nightclub I'm gonna try and spell out beat if I can moment of truth guys oh my gosh spelling things with basic shapes is so difficult guys this B is looking absolutely insane right now oh my gosh guys could you imagine me doing this without the transform tool <laughs> i literally could not okay does that look like a b okay moment of truth oh <gasps> beautiful look at that honestly a bff supermarket could never she is shaking and i'm pretty sure the original sign is black with like purple led strips around them okay there we go we have our beat nightclub sign all done and down here is going to be where the nightclub sign is going to go okay now for painting the outside we can either make it like the same concept like the brick or we can make it something different. I don't want it to be too different than the original club. If I go like random patterns like here. To see how this has like lines going on. Yeah so with the original nightclub. My only problem is that it's so dark. You literally can't even see in like at all. Okay and maybe just some like random abstract art. <laughs> using LED lights. I don't know. I'm just going to test like random things. And then see if I like it. Okay there we go. I feel like that's a little bit more neat. So that's the concept I'm going to use. I don't know. I don't know what I was thinking with this. Like, Alaska, what were you doing? Now for the door, I'm gonna add this massive tall frosted glass door. Now for the roof, I'm just gonna add a flat roof and kind of give it like a modern look. Okay, and you know what I feel like we need out here because it is gonna be dark, right? So these ceiling lamps up the top like that. Oh, okay. She killed or whatever. Okay, honestly, I don't know how I feel about the outside. So I'm just gonna leave that for the last bit and finally work on the inside. Okay, now because this is going to be a two story, I'm thinking of adding like these very elegant stairs. I'm also gonna make it like heaps bright in here like, using like nice neon colors. Before I forget, <laughs> we need a dance floor. I'm thinking that can be the dance floor. And then I can use these colorful cubes. I wanna also add a karaoke section, you know, in case people wanna like show off their karaoke skills. Actually, I might have the karaoke upstairs and that can be like the DJ booth. Guys, you know what I just realized and I'm so mad about it? These speakers don't actually work in Bloxburg. Like it's a massive scam. They don't even work. Like the absolute betrayal when I found that out. We'll also add some poles up here for um um <laughs> probably like Alaska why do you need poles in a nightclub and that's because it's it helps hold up the ceiling nothing else oh actually I'm gonna use these party pillars they're pretty cool I've never used them before so we'll see how it goes we'll add two of them oh we can't change the color of the light it's just always gonna stay green wait that kind of sucks I just got scammed oh my god wait does Boxburg have a disco ball oh <gasps> 
They have a disco ball. It's like 200 blocks bucks. You know what? It is so worth it. I want a disco ball. Oh, we need toilets as well. Okay, you know what? We'll add the toilet like here. And we'll just keep it simple. So we'll just add a toilet and a sink. Guys, this is giving me deja vu. You know, the first ever thing I built in Bloxburg was a club. I don't know why. Okay, I think that's it for the toilet. I just want to keep it very simple. And then we'll just have like the signs up here that says like men, women. We also need like a sign in area. Because there do be people trying to break in, you know? Because like in the original Bloxburg, club there's kind of like this line that you have to follow so maybe if we go in here and then you can sign in <gasps> wait do they have those like really fancy they do oh my god guys you know what we also need <laughs> on the outside two water fountains see look how sick that looks we also need like a really long carpet here salem you can't salem get your bum out of my face please okay i think the outside's kind of done here's like where you sign in so we might have like a little desk here for like security see this is where you pay to go in so i'm gonna put like a little glass cube here just in case we have some angry customers okay there we go there's our little security section like where you sign in okay, now to brighten this place up what i'm gonna do is put horizontal neon lights all around the floor trims will it be expensive yes but it'll be worth it let's petition to make this the new nightclub Okay, let's have a look. Oh, that looks sick. Okay, I'm going to do the same for the top floor, but instead of red, I'm going to use pink. Okay, that's done. Let's have a look at how this looks. Oh, I really like the way that pink turned out. I think even more than the red for some reason. You know what? I think I'm going to change the red to pink. Okay, and we also need like a radio up here so we can play some music. And I'm thinking of just adding the bar here. So that's what we're going to do. For the bar, I'm going to use these glass shelves for storage. Oh, these glass beverage dispensers. You know what? You can actually fill these up, which are pretty cool. Okay, I think the middle of the bar is gonna go here. Actually, you know what? Instead of glass cups, we can use like sauce and just paint it. These little epi sauces, we can just move them so they're facing that way. So you don't actually see the epi sauce logo, you just see the bottle. So that is exactly what we're gonna do, partner. Why did I just turn into a cowboy? You're probably like, Alaska, what are you, what's gonna be in these bottles? Um, apple juice, of course. Duh. Nothing else, I promise. Damn, okay, we are absolutely stacked. Let's see how much this costs. Oh, this costs like nearly $600 for just one shelf. Love that. Mate, we are absolutely stocked on apple juice. Oh, also, before we forget, we also need like a sign behind the DJ booth that says Beats because that's the name of the club, of course. Now, luckily for me, I can just copy this entire thing. Copying that cost $5,000. Oh, that actually looks sick. You know what I might do though? Instead of making it purple, I might change this to like blue. Say, look how much better the blue looks. Oh my gosh, I have never used this many LED strips in a build before. Maybe like another shelf up here with just like cups. Yeah, so fill up this with like poor glasses. I might just change like a bunch of these to different colors just to like spice it up a little bit because I feel like if it's the same color, it can be a little bit boring. Okay, there we go. I feel like that's um the bar done. Now we just need to do like the table. <gasps> See, look how sick that bar looks. Now we just need like a little mini fridge back here. Just need some stools around the bar. I'm just going to use these ones. These are like my favorite stools and I use them all the time. Okay, there we go. I feel like that's not too many stools and it looks good. So, okay, now just to like lighten it up a little bit. This whole thing is just made out of LED lights, like the whole thing. <laughs> okay, let's have a look. Moment of truth. Oh, <gasps> that looks sick. Okay, now for the seating. I'm going to use this contemporary dining table and add like maybe two or three seats. Oh, and maybe like a round carpet in the middle and for the chairs i might just use these stylish chairs and we'll add like four on each table for the light i'm just going to use these like mini spheres because i feel like they're not too bright which is good because i don't want it to be too bright okay i feel like that's the bottom floor all done we might just have some more lights over here because as you can see it's still a little bit dark okay there we go oh my god there's literally like so many colors going on it's crazy now for this floor which is going to be pretty simple okay there we go <gasps> wait it kind of looks like a cute cute little like romantic dinner. Also gonna do like a little corner lounge here. So with these leather lounges, I made kind of like a booth, maybe one over there and then one back here. And we'll also have some seats along here. Okay, now for the karaoke machine. I don't even know how I'm gonna build a karaoke machine. Oh, well, I guess you can just I have a few ideas. You know, on my Discord channel, there's actually karaoke nights and like people literally get into it. And if you sing in karaoke night, you get your own custom role. <laughs> 
called karaoke singer. It's really funny. So if you ever want to have karaoke nights, feel free to join my Discord server. There we go. I kind of made like a little stage. Okay, I need like a little chandelier shining on whoever's like singing karaoke. So maybe that one. Okay, now we just need a little microphone. I don't have microphones, so I'm just going to have to build my own. Okay, there we go. We have our little microphone thing. Now we just need some TVs because you know how like every karaoke place has um TV with the lyric? We might just add like two there. And then we'll just have this little painting stand that says like karaoke. Also, um, I feel like we're missing some plants, so I'm just gonna quickly add them. Actually, you know what? This can be like the VIP section. So I might put a fence here and then like a little thing that says VIP only. Okay, I think that's the club done. So I'm just gonna add some like finishing touches and then change the decals. And then I shall give you a little tour of the place. All right, the renovated nightclub is finally complete. And I mean, guys, look at how incredible this looks like this looks like you need to hire me for real honestly i had like a love-hate relationship with how this like, wall turned out but at the end i think it really came together really nicely i really did not know what to do here I had builder's block but i feel like it turned out good okay so let's make our way inside so we have our little walkway that goes to the desk where you pay so please pay here so obviously there'll be like a security guard working here and you kind of just pay him to have access to the club there's so many things to look at it's like whoa so obviously i had to add some bathrooms they're literally like the same thing we just have like a girl's bathroom and a boy's bathroom but yeah pretty basic and then over here we have some seating if people want to like sit down have a drink and like talk to their friends and here's the massive dance floor where you can rock out your incredible emotes I actually can't do a cartwheel in real life fun fact but look how sick this looks like from this angle and here's like the little dj booth and then there'll be like a bunch of people on the dance floor so pretty cute and then over here is the bar where you get your drinks um <clears throat> where you get your apple juice so we are set in the drink department. Okay, now as you can see here, we have a karaoke sign. So coming upstairs, this is the fun bit, right? I didn't know these changed colors. I thought they just stayed green. Like, look how cool that is. They change colors. But yeah, here's like the little balcony area. And then over here, we have our karaoke machine, karaoke section. These are like TVs, but like technically they're gonna be song lyrics and then you can just like sing your favorite song. Yeah. <laughs> And then we just got like more seating over here. Cute little like romantic dinner right here. And then finally we have our VIP lounge. It's literally just like one lounge. <laughs> I feel like I could have done more of the VIP section. But yeah, that's basically it. The VIP section does get like a pretty cool view like of the entire club, which is pretty nice. But yeah, that's the entire club all complete. So anyway, guys, that was me renovating the Beat Night Club in Bloxburg. And if you want to watch me renovate another Bloxburg building, make sure you hit subscribe. And I will see you in the next video. Bye.